In this video, we'll show you how to update firmware on your DeLorme inReach. First, we need to dig out the USB cable. Note that we take the uh, micro USB cable. So we'll need to open up the battery case here and uh, just plug in one end of the USB cable. The other end is plugged into a Mac. We can very well use a PC because the update is web-based. It doesn't really matter. So now what we need to do is put the device into update mode. So we're going to hold down the message and tracking buttons together. Then we'll hold down the power button until we get the flashing red and green LED lights. That will tell us that the device is in uh, update mode, ready to receive the firmware. So what we're going to do now is log in to our explore.delorme.com website. This is our uh, control panel that controls our device. Get ready to update the firmware. Either we will see a message here on the right, or we can go through uh, the settings tab to get to the uh, firmware page. Now we have to look underneath our battery case uh, to get the authorization code. And once we select which version of the inReach we're about ready to go. If you haven't done an update on DeLorme before, you might have to install the uh, DeLorme GPS plugin before you get to this stage. Uh, it's a very quick process, but once you get back, you can get back to this page and start updating the firmware. It's a very fast uh, process actually, so we're just gonna sit back and watch this go. Uh, you'll probably notice that the lights on the uh, inReach will start to flash differently once you get different stages of the, the process. But otherwise, it should just take maybe about another minute. All right, at this point, the update's complete. We can go back to our device. It should be turned off automatically, so it's safe to unplug the USB cable. And all we have to do now is just put in uh, the batteries, and we should be good to go. But in my case, when I disconnected and put in the batteries, my power LED was solid green. So I tried to do the firmware update again, didn't quite work, went to a Windows box, tried that a couple of times, didn't work for me. So I had to call tech support, which is in Canada, inReach, instead of DeLorme, and we went through the same scenarios again. Their workaround is basically to try to just rewrite or re-push the firmware update again but in my case that didn't work so they were very good and sent me a replacement unit got it in the next day so uh, when you do get in reach any problems contact customer support that doesn't work but in most cases you should just be able to do what we did previously in the video to update your firmware and you should be good to go pair it now we only need to do this once next time that we'll use the device we'll just power on normally now what we can do is we can switch over to the EarthMate app. That's a free download. Now it's important to have your inReach activated first. 